Well, hi, good morning. Welcome to Ships and Shipping, coming to you from the viewpoint at the Port of Phillips though today. It's Sunday the 28th of April. It's uh, just about 8.20 a.m., goodness me. And uh, it's coming up to low water, I think, fairly soon. And uh, we're looking out at berths 8 and 9 at Phillips there. We're also looking up at the far end. You can see in the distance berths 6 and 7. And uh, I have to tell you, today is a pretty quiet Sunday. It's one of those things that happens from time to time. We've got uh, both berths on the 8 and 9 occupied. And along the other berths, there's just one ship, which is a relatively, well, no, pretty small um, offshore service vessel. Um, and I don't know that what she's there for. I assume she's probably there to load something a bit unusual. But uh, we'll have a look and see later in the day and see what's happening there but it is a really quiet sunday i have to say it's also interesting to see that uh what we've actually got alongside eight and nine we've got a smaller ship i think she's about four thousand four thousand two hundred to you something like that virgo which just happens to be <laughs> my birth sign and we've also got uh, ever a lot which is of course uh, twenty four thousand to you giant and uh, we've got a video showing them together and giving you a bit of a comparison between the two, which is coming up in the next, I guess, probably in the next hour or maybe two. Uh, we're going to do, I think, probably an unusual thing with that. We're going to voice over it for a bit and uh, give you a comparison between those two ships, which will be interesting. Interesting from my point of view as well, of course, because it does mean that I shall have to do a bit more research uh, to do a decent... Um, voiceover to give you a decent amount of, of information there you have it but uh, there you go that is this morning it's very quiet and uh, looking ahead let's just have a look ahead at what we've got i think the only other activity uh, we've got today is ferries the virgo is not due out until tomorrow early in the morning if she's delayed on that time i may get a shot of her leaving uh, we've also got let's see have a lot and she's not due out until the early hours of Monday. Goodness me. No, Tuesday, sorry. Until the early hours of Tuesday. And apart from that, the only other activity we've got today is ferries. During daylight hours tomorrow, we've got Hong Kong 5, MSC Hong Kong 5 due in. Uh, we've got CMA CGM Bellini due in. We have got Maersk Horsburgh do in in the early evening and then uh, nothing dramatic or exciting until let's have a look see oh right okay on Tuesday Demetra C I don't know much about her she's working for Maersk line and um, she's doing fairly early but during daylight hours on Tuesday so you might try and catch her and we'll see how that all goes then MSC Loretto is doing on Tuesday afternoon up at Trinity. So um, that'll be interesting to see. So we have got a bit of traffic coming in. Things will brighten up. It's one of those things that seems to happen at Felix Day. If we had the two ships alongside at, say, London Gateway, then London Gateway would be busy. But before, because Felix Day has got effectively four or five, well, four big berths and some more, uh, if you've got two ships alongside, it looks very quiet. So don't compare too much, and you can't really compare too badly between the two. Okay, I'm Chris. This is Ships and Shipping. It is Sunday, my goodness, the 28th of April 2024, and I have to tell you that I'm now going home, and I have planned a mushroom omelette for my Sunday treat breakfast. Okay. Let me just put up the correct piece for all those things that we have to do. And we'll be coming to you as well with some interesting news over today. Uh, over today, probably tomorrow, in fact, thinking about it. Uh, because we've got some interesting changes, which I think are going to um, make it a lot more interesting for a lot of people. We'll see how it all goes. In the meantime, thanks very much for watching. If you have been, I'm Chris. This is Ships and Shipping. And we will see you soon. Coming up to... 8.25 in the a.m. See you soon. Take care now. Bye.